Let's talk accessories. First of all, you would of course insert a micro SD card into the Raspberry Pi 02W. This one is 64 GB and already has a Raspberry Pi OS on it. This is the mini HDMI adapter, which you can plug into the mini HDMI port of a 02W to be able to insert a full-sized HDMI cable into it. By the way, Raspberry Pi does not encourage similar solutions for the Pi 4's micro HDMI sockets, as the mechanical strain would be too big. To plug in USB devices, we use the micro USB OTG adapter. For example, I like the Logitech K400 and this uh, is the receiver of this uh, keyboard and touchpad combination, which I can plug in right here, and then it goes into the micro USB port, which is titled USB on the 02W. Finally, to connect a camera to the 02W, we need to use this camera adapter. Here we have a Raspberry Pi camera, for example, and here we have the original Raspberry Pi Zero case. As you can see, the case has three different lids. One of them is solid, one of them has an opening for the GPIO port, and one of them is meant to house the camera. Inside the case you will find a small camera adapter, which we will be using to mount the Pi with the camera into the case, and rubber feet to be attached at the back side of the case. First of all, let's take care of the camera. We have to open the clip at the back side to remove the cable and mount it. Also remove the little um, protective shield which is here in order to open the lens. Put it in the right way. Needs to face into the opening and then click it into place. Be careful to not to exert too much pressure and to not touch the lens while mounting it. Afterwards you can insert the cable into the camera and close it. After that we are going to attach the camera to the zero also by opening the flap and inserting the camera connector. Now the two parts are connected and we can click the zero into place in its case. Note that the SD card should be mounted at this point because otherwise you will need to open it again. The zero clicks into place as you can see and then we can close the lid and we have a nice little security camera. A good alternative case to the official Pi Zero uh, case is the Flerk case. The Flerk case has the big advantage that it acts as a heatsink. And you can even mount a camera with this case. Then uh, you will be using the long camera adapter and it will go in this way. We are now ready to connect the power to the Raspberry Pi 2W. As always, remember to use a good quality power supply. This one is a Raspberry Pi original power supply, which we are shipping with our kits. Plug the power right in here. And remember, if the LED does not light up, first check the micro SD card whether it has a valid operating system. The big upside about all these accessories is that the 02 follows the 0 form factor very closely. 
Most accessories you've already purchased for the Zero should just work with the Zero too, including the original Pi Zero case and the Flurk Zero case.